Welcome back all morning long. I've been in Winter Haven getting to know our neighbors in this part of Polk County. Let's introduce you to them very quickly. Thank you everybody for being here. Listen, we have, we can do better than that. And I want to say the social distancing, you know, is good because we have two members from Winter Haven Hospital here with us, Nancy and Tracy. Thank you guys so much for stopping in. Commissioner Yates is here as well. We're going to talk to more of them coming up on our streaming news channel. I want to talk real quickly about Winter Haven's Snively Elementary, a Title I school, which means it has a majority of students from lower income families, and it's finding some great success too. Over the past few years, they've been working really hard to beautify the school thanks to Polk County Schools community liaison and community partners. These amazing murals you're seeing on the screen, they're even on the inside making the school feel more welcoming and also increasing student attendance. As uh, we beautify the campus and get them to want to be here and desire to be here a little bit more, that's going to help us meet those goals, which are going to help also in our academic goals. Every mural that was painted by artists that we, that we brought in um, was done for free. Everyone that took part in the project from both perspectives uh, did so you know, from the kindness of their heart. They, they believe in what um, art can do in the lives of children, and they did this you know, for the kids. I cannot think of a more beautiful way to end this. The school also went from a D-rated school to a C based on things like graduation rate. And this year, they're working on the garden and making it a teaching outdoor classroom. Read more about their success on abcactionnews.com slash winterhaven. Guys, one more time.